Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to find out if your email address has been involved in a data breach, and if so, which ones. Uh, so there's many websites that will offer this service, so we're just going to go over one of the more popular ones today and show you how it works, and that way you could you know, add your email address in there and see if you've been compromised and if you need to do some password changing. So the one we're going to use is the Avast Hack Check. So Avast, you might know they make antivirus software. They have some free stuff, which is pretty good, and some pay-for stuff. So once you go to this uh, website, so I'll put a link in the description, you just enter your email address here. So I'm just going to put a generic one here. That's got to be in use. This is not my email, but somebody named steve at gmail.com has got to exist. And then you probably want to uncheck this, otherwise you'll be getting a bunch of junk mail. And click on Check Now. And then they'll send you an email to that email address that has all the passwords that your account was involved in. And once you uh, go to that email, it'll look something like this. So it'll tell you the name of the uh, website and when it was discovered. And you can just kind of scroll down and see them all. And then if you click on Show Details at the bottom the button in the email, that'll take you to this page. I'm just kind of jumping around here because I didn't have a test email address that was compromised. So here's some details about that. You can see the leak. You know, and then you can just kind of go through each one of these to see the details. They you know, may not be helpful. It just kind of tells you what happened. But anyways, for all of these websites, if you're still using them or even if you're not, you probably want to go there and change your uh, login password because there's a good chance that somebody else has it. So once again... You just go to this website here, put in an email address, uncheck that box most likely, check now. It'll tell you what it found. It'll send you an email that looks like this with all the results. Then you can click on show details and it'll take you to the details where you can see information about the leak and then go about, you know, going to all these sites and changing your password. And like I said, there's other sites you could do it on so they might have uh, other stuff that this didn't find so you could try those as well. Just you know, make sure they're legitimate sites before you start putting in your email because you don't want to get even more junk email. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.